the Lonely People by Mike Gale. From the Richard and Judy best-selling author of Half a World Away comes a warm, life-affirming story. The perfect read for these times. I'm a huge Mike Gale fan. Read this in one sitting. He is such an expert in penning stories that you simply can't put down. He creates characters that you fall in love with, you root for, you cry for. It's the second consecutive book of his that's made me teary. This book feels like it's written for exactly this moment in time. It tackles some big issues but in a more intelligent manner than most. Another beautifully penned must read for anyone wanting to feel hope and who have the desire to live in a better world. An adorable book about loneliness, friendship, acceptance and how our life is in our control. Hubert, an 84-year-old widower is sort of dragged out of loneliness by his new neighbor, Ashley, a 24-year-old and her daughter, Layla. Through this newly formed friendship, Hubert meets new people, starts new projects and learns to let go of the past that has hurt him so much. An inspiring book, great for a light read. I don't normally go for books where one of the main characters is old because I find them depressing, but having read Half a World Away, I thought Mike Gale would capture me with another story. And I was right. It was nice to see how the author touches on difficult themes, such as racism, mixed race couples, substance abuse, falling out of contact with your friends, leaving your home country and losing a dear one. This is truly a gem of a book, I absolutely adored every page. Hubert is just the most engaging character and you completely take him into your heart unreservedly. We see Hubert when he first comes to the UK from Jamaica in the 50s and see the difficulties that he, and so many others faced and we see him in the modern day, adjusting to a life alone. This book deals with some important issues such as loneliness, family, love, friendship, prejudice, loss and dealing with losing someone you love to the horror that is drug addiction. Hubert meets, reluctantly, his new neighbor, Ashley, who is reaching out for support and a connection. You have to love her too. All the supporting characters are also so endearing, loved Emile and they represent hope and friendship when it is needed most. Despite dealing with some difficult issues there is also humor and so much warmth in this novel. I loved it and it is now my favorite Mike Gale book. It put me slightly in mind of, A Man Called Over, which is another book that I loved. Read it. A thought-provoking and poignant novel from Mike Gale. I have thoroughly enjoyed reading, All the Lonely People, and after reading to the last chapter I have decided that this book is his finest story to date. The book gives a realistic description of the life of a person from the Caribbean coming to England after World War II. The description gives a cringing feeling in the bottom of the stomach, when the reality of the negative reaction that newly settled people experienced from the rest of society. The main protagonist is a friendly and likable character. For three quarters of the book the tension of wondering what would happen next was sustained. I did wonder if the author found it difficult to end the story. The driving force to make friendships was pointless, when the reason for the change in lifestyle was for a daughter who was more of a figment of the imagination. A thought-provoking and poignant novel from Mike Gale. I have thoroughly enjoyed reading, All the Lonely People, and after reading to the last chapter I have decided that this book is his finest story to date. The lovely interaction between young Ashley, and Hubert conveys how beautiful a friendship can actually be between an old man and a young lady. The book also spun some surprises, and there were quite a few gut-wrenching plot twists in this novel, totally unexpected, and I am still in a state of shock at their appearance especially chapter 39. But, hey, fabulous writing and a beautiful storyline. I am a real fan of Mike Gale since I have turned 30. I have read all the books since then. I liked all of them a lot but Hubert's story has really resonated with me the most since turning 30. Highly recommended. Anyone who is after a real heartbreaking, emotional, and inspiring story will not put this book aside until reading the very last page. Thanks Mike Gale, I really love this book. You are a star. Click link in description for more reviews.